Okay, today I am going to show you the system settings for Nodes Player Emulator. Um, here we go. We go to Advanced Settings, Performance Settings, Custom. You need to change this value. For me, it's CPU, two cores, and the RAM memory. It's for my PC, it's 8 gigabytes, so I put like 6 gigabytes to run faster the, the game. Now, the resolution setting, it's, I put this uh, very low because I try to improve the performance too. And the graphics rendering mode. I put a speed direct and frame settings 30. It's better for 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 Pokemon Go because if you if you put a uh, 60 uh, frames, it's very laggy the the game. Okay. You need to. You need to check your computer to for this. For example, my computer. I have the the processor. It's i7, and the RAM memory is eight gigabytes. So if you have a better uh, pro processor and with with cores with many codes for my proce my processor it's just two cores so I put that in my emulator and that's it I'm going to show you how how this uh, game works better Do you want to change your virtual location? You need to go here. For example, I am here. Uh, if if I want if I want to move here, go and move here. Okay. I am here now. If you want to reduce more your lag, um, I'm going to show you something else. We go here, settings. After that, developer options. And we go here. We need to put animation off in window animation scale. The same for animator duration scale and and transition animation scale. Okay. Uh, you you should check this option for GPU rendering and. Okay, I think this with that it's enough. So
if you put this um, speed direct act you need to update the light the last the last direct for for this so that is my recommendation and I hope that this was very helpful for many people so see you next time bye bye